we'll be showing you all the reports that are available in the Autosys platform. So the first thing as always, you want to go ahead and uh, either select one of your vehicles uh, from the garage. If you uh, have folders set up, you could also go and jump to the report section here. So there's a couple ways to access it. You could also hit the drop down in the top right and access the reports button. And then when you're actually inside a vehicle or asset, like for example, inside unit 100, there's also a reports icon here. So there's multiple ways where you can uh, access the reports. If you click on reports, it'll take you to the reports dashboard. This is where you have a list of all the different reports we have. Um, the first report is the reminder and inspection dashboard. This is a great way to kind of get a global view of what's going on inside your fleet. For example, you can see how many total assets you have, total users, your running costs. Uh, all the open reminders and what's coming up soon, work orders, the inspection with issues, uh, low on inventory, and so on. So this is a, a great way to kind of just get a good pulse of what's going on in the fleet. You could also filter and break it down uh, if you'd like to uh, select a specific folder that you want to see the data for or a specific vehicle. And then you can also change uh, the date range and pick a, a custom date range or if you want to see maybe what's going on in the last 12 months. So that's a great way to filter it. And then on top of that, it will allow you to um, kind of see all the different reminders you have open. Again, this is across all your different vehicles and assets in the fleet as, uh, you know, not just one. You can filter uh, a couple of different ways. And then same with the work orders. You can see what's going on and then also the inspections with issues. Uh, if you hit back to reports, you can see more of your different reports here. The inspection submission analysis. Uh, this is a great report if you want to do a quick audit to see who's been submitting inspections on your vehicles and assets. Again, you could pick a custom date range um, and then kind of see, hey, you know what, let's see what has been going on for the past month or so. This will allow you to kind of see who's been submitting inspections, uh, how many, which vehicle, and then you can kind of audit to see, hey, you know what, there's a couple, number of uh, uh, vehicles and assets that don't have inspections submitted, and you can also export the data. The next report we have is the Excel export analysis. This allows you to export all the data that you've inputted into AutoSyst, and it'll put it out into an Excel file for you. So if you hit click to run report, you could either select by folder, uh, select your entire fleet or select a particular vehicle. And then you can also pick a date range here as well. And then this will basically uh, allow you to kind of select. So I'm gonna hit all time and I'm gonna hit all vehicles and I hit download. And then this will download into a nice uh, spreadsheet for you. So you have all your data here. First tab will show you all your vehicle information. Uh, year, make, model, VIN numbers, and so on. And then at the bottom, you have all the different tabs. So this will match with all the different tabs that are within AutoSys. So all your service data here, fuel, reminders, work orders, glove box, notes, inspections, trip log, any other custom sections you have, and then also all your users. So this is a, a great tool for uh, being able to kind of get all your data on a nice spreadsheet. Um, you could also... Um, run the spend analysis report. This is a great report that allows you to uh, kind of see how much you're spending on a particular vehicle or the entire fleet. So if you hit run, uh, again, select by folder, by all vehicles, by a certain vehicle and in a date range, I'm gonna go ahead and click uh, this Cayenne here. I'm gonna hit open. And then now I see a full breakdown of how much I've spent on service and how much I've spent on fuel. And uh, it's just a nice way to kind of get the health of the vehicle to see uh, how it's doing. The other reports we have is the service history report. If you'd like to compile all your service records with the receipts and attachments that you've added to the service section, this would be a great report to run. Again, you could filter by a number of different options and then hit open. And then it will basically compile all your services for that particular asset in a nice uh, PDF file and give you all the records that you've, um, you know, that you've attached uh, to that, uh, to those services. Um, another report we have is uh, the backup data option. If you want to export all your data out, attachments, um, and have everything on an Excel file, uh, we do our own backups uh, every hour. Uh, however, uh, you do have the ability to download on demand to your computer uh, or your device at any time. Uh, 
The next report would be the user login report. This is a very basic report to see who's been logging in, when they signed up last, and just making sure people are using the system that are part of your account. The odometer history report will check uh, how often the odometer has been updated within uh, uh, your specific vehicle or asset, and uh, it will show you the average miles or hours or however you're tracking uh, your mileage or odometer. So you can uh, run that report. The inspection history is a little bit more of an advanced uh, report if you need to ever do an audit or need to see uh, you know, what was marked not in proper order or any issues that you have with inspections. It will export everything out to Excel. You can um, select different checklists if you have multiple checklists. You can do it with comments, without comments, and, and basically get all your inspection data on, that was been submitted into Autosys onto an Excel report. And then this is a fairly new report. We have the depreciation calculator. This is where you can um, kind of do a straight line depreciation and kind of measure to see uh, uh, you know, the, 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 the straight line depreciation of that specific vehicle or asset. Uh, we also have custom reports that we can build for you. Um, you know, those are done on a case by case basis, but if you have something you would like to see or a certain format, we build custom reports all the time. Um, you can email us anytime at support at autosys.com and we can uh, go ahead and uh, let you know uh, what, what we could do to help you build the report if there's something in particular you want. Um, so that is it for the report section. We hope you found this video helpful. If you have any additional questions on how to better manage your fleet, please give us a call toll-free at 888-316-5877, or you can email us at info at You can also see more product demo videos and information via our website at autosys.com.